Hello! I'm trying something a little different for this video, obviously because I'm narrating and I don't usually do that. I don't think I was actually planning on doing any narrations. Well, not anytime soon anyway. I think I wanted to try it eventually, but I was just kind of nervous to like talk over my videos and stuff. Because I don't really have anything to talk about. But I guess I'll just talk about the video. So I remember like last year, mostly on Tumblr, I kept seeing people do like those color palette challenge things. And I always wanted to do it, but I just never got around to trying it. So I thought I would just do one of those. Uh, the picture is just some random girl I drew. I mostly wanted to just practice drawing like wavy, flowy hair because I've always kind of had trouble with that. So I think the hair turned out kind of nicely. I don't know what the heck she's doing with her hand. It's just kind of random. I don't know. Just ignore it, I guess. <laughs> Fucking hands. Um. Oh, yeah. The reason I'm doing this narration is because I started looking at my YouTube analytics. And I've noticed that most people don't really watch the full length of my speed paints. Which is, I guess, understandable. I mean... Sometimes when I'm watching speed paints, I just kind of watch like the beginning part or I just kind of skip through it and stuff. But I wanted to kind of make the video more interesting or more engaging, I guess. So I thought me talking over it would kind of keep people listening more, I think, I guess. Even though I don't really have anything that interesting to say, but it's my first time. So cut me some slack. Oh my god, that hand was so horrible. Uh, just don't look at the hand. Um, I kind of had trouble with this picture, actually. Mostly with uh, coloring in her skin. Here I'm just like... I don't know. I did something different. I don't know why. I usually color each uh, section at a time. Like, usually start with, like, skin and then hair and then, like, clothing or whatever. So, I don't know what the heck. Don't, this beginning part is just not what I usually do at all. I tried doing it on, like, one layer, but it was just too frustrating. As you can see, I was just like, ugh. So, then I just kind of quit doing that. So, then after this part's done, I just went back to doing what I usually do. Just using the magic wand tool and, like... Selecting certain parts of the line art and stuff because that's what I usually do. I just I'm just really lazy at filling in Like what you're supposed to color manually because I'm a lazy person. So I'm like, I'm just gonna use the magic wand tool And that's what I do. It's like my best friend. I also was experimenting with the layer folder things. I don't know what they're called. I think they're called like layer sets or something um yeah, I was just playing around with that. I didn't really know what I was doing. Um, I chose this palette because I really like purple. And I thought it would give me a good challenge, I guess. Because I don't do a lot of greens or anything. And I think this uh, challenge actually did help me, though, learn, like, color-wise stuff. Because usually, like, when I shade, you know how you just have your base color and then you have like a darker color of that base color and so on and so forth like I usually just kind of do that but having different colors in for the color scheme was kind of challenging so I thought that was a good way to practice I did learn a lot from this I think I really did like how I did the hair though that's usually like my favorite part of all my pictures because that's the one I spend the most time on I always have trouble coloring the skin and, and definitely clothing. Like, I need to learn how to draw clothes better, I think. Because I'm just not very good at, like, the folds and whatnot. But, yeah, I haven't been practicing drawing as much. Because, I don't know, I've just been busy lately. I wanted to try to get a video out every week. Obviously, I haven't been keeping up with that. Because I haven't uploaded my last video since, like... February, I think. So it's been a good two months. Um, Awkward pause. Yeah, I didn't know what the outfit was supposed to be. Or the pose. Anything. I just kind of randomly drew it and just went with it. Um, The cape looked better when you could actually see the hood part of it. But I really wanted to show the hair because I was proud of it. So 
I had to cover that up. I find myself doing that a lot, like, in my drawings. If I'm really proud of, like, one part of it, I don't want to, like, cover it up or something. So I try to not hide it. Especially, like, when I'm drawing um, figures, like, if I'm drawing a girl and I'm like, oh, I really like how I drew her legs. Like, well, I don't want to cover up her legs, you know, so I got to try and show that. Obviously, this one doesn't have legs because it just goes up to, like, her hip. But, yeah. Um, I don't think I really liked how I colored in the cape. I didn't really, I don't think I really knew what colors I wanted to go with. The dress I was kind of more proud of, I kind of like how I kind of did it backwards instead of doing like light to dark I kind of did um the highlights first which was kind of interesting I've never really done that before but um yeah uh never really did this kind of thing before so I don't know maybe I can do this again I kind of just like having music in the background but most people don't like sitting through that. I guess it's kind of boring. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll do this again sometime. guess I'll just stop talking since it's going to end. Bye.